everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to show you a little behind the scenes footage of creating the TK Maxx and HomeSense series sofa sessions. So I headed down to London for a couple of days to film and was surrounded by beautiful furniture and gifts in a HomeSense superstore. Kind of lethal when you're meant to be working, but itching to buy it all. The team created a beautiful set in store so I thought you might like to see what goes into filming an episode like this and of course all the beautiful pieces I found along the way. And at the end of this video you can see the final result of everyone's hard work. Hi I'm Jess, welcome to Sofa Sessions, the show where I get to help my guests find TK Maxx and HomeSense treasures. So we are in the office stroke makeup room. This is the lovely Sophie. Hello. What am I going to do to your face today? Um, smoky eye? Yeah. Any false lashes? Mm -hmm. I was taking lashes off last night. I wasn't oh, sure yes. which ones were mine. And oh, yeah. <laughs> I was hoping that you... I, I did forget to say to you before you went, don't worry. Well, I just kept pulling and yeah. thought, well, but surely the right ones will come out. <laughs> <laughs> what foundation did you use on me? I use Laura Mercier. She's the most It's the oil-free. Put it on camera so you don't get too shiny. Okay. It was one of these ones, I think it was sand. Okay. It's got a good glow already. Um, it's just nicer, because right. it's lighter. Okay. You've got amazing skin. Mm, <laughs> Sophie and I are going to have a little mooch around the store. Should we go and see what we can find? Let's go have a look. What are you looking for? What am I looking We're not for? supposed to be Probably looking for anything. Lip balms, bronzers. More actually, makeup. anything. Do you not think you've got enough makeup? I in do. There? Actually, I'm obsessed with it. Like, I'd take these. Not yeah. that, honestly, I would take anything. Yeah. <laughs> We're just looking easy. for sparkly new things. I just can't come in this shop because I end up coming out with everything. Yes. So I like it's a trove. It is, isn't it? The things you didn't even know you needed. Didn't even know I needed. But then you can't resist. Yeah, literally. <laughs> and is it this one? And hold it down. I think I already pressed record. It's. <laughs> If you... <laughs> no, it's <laughs> you wouldn't believe it's in a photography course, would you? Lovely green chairs. Which doesn't really go with my theme, but they're really comfy. That's nice. What is your theme? Well, pink, it's really original. Pink, greys, a little bit of brass in there. Mm -hmm. um, nice soft tones, I think. Mm -hmm. And I did find this chair earlier that I really like. I was thinking there's lots and lots of velvet around at the minute, so just to be a little bit different, I found one in cotton. Ooh. I thought it wouldn't maybe date as quickly. I don't know if that's the right thinking. Yeah. It's comfy actually. That one is comfy though, the round one. Is it? I sat in it before. And it spins. It does fall. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It's a spinning one. It's a spinning one. Jazzy. <laughs> oh, it does. It's so comfy. Isn't it? Oh, I like that. <laughs> Yeah, I like that one. And I love this table. There's two designs of that. Yeah. They've got a different kind of thing on the table going on. So I thought that was two chairs, but I'm kind of torn now with your spinning number. <laughs> I don't know if this is a good idea or not. But I was thinking playroom for the boys. I like this. Is it comfy? Oh, it's really comfy. Is it? It's really Although, will the boys not drop stuff and make marks all over the sofa? Yes. <laughs> it looks lovely. It will stay looking just like this. It's not going to have a bit of yogurt and a smoothie and a bit of chocolate smeared across the arm. It will stay small, just like this. <laughs> the most impractical sofa for boys yeah. for a boys' playroom. Yeah. <laughs> Ridiculous. I don't do practicality. Oh, we've got another spinny number there. Not sure. where we've been filming. They turn on all these big lights and we've got some lovely blush coloured chairs over here. But that actually is just my cup of tea. And they've gone for the brass table again, which is really nice. And I've got like that grey uh, chest at the side as well. I'm thinking in the house, we're going to have an open plan kitchen living diner. Mm -hmm. with, so sofa in there, so the kids will probably be in there a lot. 
We've got the playroom with the really practical pink sofa. <laughs> pink velvet, no less. So I'm gonna need somewhere I can retreat to in my own home office. Is that comfy, that one? It is. Just try. Yeah, it's wide enough to get your feet up. And then equally, I thought it would be nice to film my YouTube videos for that. Yeah. So we're gonna do a bit of touch up on makeup and then I think we're gonna start filming. And one quick reminder of the scripts and we should be good to go. So, favourite products from a makeup artist, what favorite. would you say? Um, the NARS Creamy Stick Concealers are amazing. Yes. And concealer, like we were saying yesterday, um, is our one main thing. Our desert island. Desert island, yeah. <laughs> Product. Um, individual lashes, my yeah. favourite thing. They looked fab when you put they them did, on. They did, didn't they? Yeah. They just look really natural. Yeah, just opens the eyes. Favourite moisturiser? Favourite moisturiser. There is a Bobbi Brown and it smells like um, oranges and it's really good it's, it's like a primer and it helps to make it stay all day um, that is gorgeous Jess give us a wave so after interviewing three lovely women and a few takes later here is one of the finished episodes I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below and thank you as always for watching 99 oh my goodness <laughs> I really like this we might have to get some of those from Sal yeah. and we haven't spent fortune whatsoever yeah Hi, I'm Jess. Welcome to Sofa Sessions, the show where I get to help my guests find TK Maxx and HomeSense treasures. Today, I'm at a TK Maxx and HomeSense superstore, the perfect place to find unique and branded homeware. There's new items every week at incredible prices, so you know you can always go home with something truly special. I'm joined by the beautiful Chantelle. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> so Chantelle, tell us a bit about yourself. First and foremost, I'm a mum. I'm also writing a book. I have Instagram talking about lifestyle, parenting. So yeah, I'm pretty busy. So in between being a mum and all the busyness that comes with that, do you ever find yourself shopping in TK Maxx and HomeSense? So I actually go to TK Maxx all the time. I feel like I could go in there and I can't leave without buying something. <laughs> Is there anything particular you want to get? In my whole house we have three photos on the wall. I know and I've got like a beautiful family of three daughters and there's not one photo of the three of them on the wall so photo frames to like decorate. Well we are sat here amongst some beautiful furniture and homewares and we've got this very sparkly lovely looking gift card for Fabulous. you. So we're gonna have 60 minutes to go on a treasure hunt around the store and see if we can find some beautiful items for your home. Are you up for it? Yes I am. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, I love this one. And then maybe like something like this in front. Love a bit of pan on pan. Beautiful. Good quality. Soft. I love greys yeah. in the home. I think it's just that really is. soothing. I need soothing with all my children. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is cute. My daughter would love this. And it feels quite sturdy as well. Very actually. sturdy. Good quality. Very sturdy. This is why I love TK Maxx, because you have items like this. Something just a little bit different. Yeah, no one else is going to have this. That would be like, Dakota, get ready for school. <laughs> Plant heaven here. I feel like this is a massive wow statement. Yeah, it is. And I like this. And that would all work with the grey that you've got in your it hallway would. as well. And my front door. The quality on that is amazing. You have to feel it to think, oh, is it real or not? Oh, smell that. <laughs> yeah, candle selection is <gasps> always the best. Well, Nan and Grenon always had a magnifying glass in their lounge. There's such a nice sentiment there if it reminds you of a family member. And it's six pounds. Wow. Oh, I'm liking this whole corner yeah. over here. I've actually been looking for something like this for my hallway. Amazing quality. Yeah, really actually. good quality. And I love the gold. Photo frame. Mm, just what we needed. One for each child, Dakota, Tatum and Blakely. Yeah, perfect. Seen gold photo frames. It's actually my Nan's birthday. Oh, really? Yeah, it is, and I need to get her something. Why don't I go off and have a little look about for your Nan while you keep shopping okay. here? Something like that is quite nice, just as a wrap. It's already gift wrapped as well, so that's perfect. Five minute warning, I'm gonna see you back at the sofa. Okay, cool, I'll okay. see you there. Okay, so you've been on a treasure hunt and it looks like you've found some beautiful items here. Do you wanna show me what you've got? 
saw this frame and it matches with my colour theme. What about this plant here? I absolutely love plants that like droop down. Yes. Both very in fashion. Seen it all over Instagram. Yeah. Five ninety nine. That's incredible. And what else have we got there? So the pineapple. You know, chuck your keys in there on something pretty. Yeah. I like that. And a magnifying glass. I absolutely love magnifying glasses. You no, know, like read your post like this. <laughs> and then we've got the cushions. Blush pink and obviously the gold running through. I think the quality on that looks incredible and nice and squidgy it too. Is. What did you get for your nan? I just know that she would love these on her bedside table. Mm -hmm. Every morning she could wake up, have a picture of my girls. Now while you were doing some shopping, I was having a little mooch around the store myself and I found something that I thought would be the perfect present for yours. It is a very snuggly looking dressing gown. It is. So what would you like to choose? The dressing gown or the frames for your nan? Am I allowed to choose this for myself? <laughs> but I feel like my nan's very sentimental. Yes. So I feel like if I was to give her a picture frame of the girls, I know that she'd, she'd probably cry. <laughs> oh. Great gift there for her. Thank you. <laughs> Hi Jess, I just wanted to say thank you so much for helping me pick out the perfect present for my nan. I did give her the frames with the photos of the girls in. Massive thank you once again. Thanks Chantel, I'm so happy to hear your nan loved the gift that you got for her. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave us a comment below about what you thought to all the items we found. Did you like what we got? What was your favorite? Would you choose something different? Or what would you buy for your own nan? We'll see you next time on the sofa for more sofa sessions.